The biggest changes are the collaboration between the teachers. So I've gone to a flexible learning space, um, so no walls. So teachers are quite transparent with their programmes and, um, and the learning going on within what we call the learning zone. Um, so teachers are planning collaboratively, they are sharing. So I've got, um, I've got one teacher who's more digitally capable, capable than another. Um, and yet the other one's got very good sound pedagogy, so there's a lovely balance in the room. So they're sharing and um, working closely alongside one another. So from a teaching point of view, um, being able to share practice has been be very beneficial. But for having the children having access to one-to-one -one device, powerful engagement and um, purposeful tasks, and transparency between school and home because through the class site parents can access the learning and um, can see the teacher's learning intentions and the success criteria and it's just opened up our classrooms through a digital platform. For the students, personal ownership for learning. Learning happening 24-7, we have to monitor that very carefully because some children will stay connected for a long, long time. So we're very interested to know what time they're starting and what time they're finishing. Um, becoming more digitally responsible, um, understanding about being safe online. And um, again, collab powerful collaboration of sharing one another's work and commenting appropriately on one another's work. So they've got a bigger audience. Often, especially around writing, writing ends up being quite personal. Um, and now they've got a purpose and an audience. It's wonderful. I'm not only the principal of Christ the King, I've got a little son in the digital environment. And um, I think I was really sold on the programme when I saw my own son come home very excited about sharing his work online and through, the Google, through his Google account. Um, and he's only eight and he's got a Google account. But he was so proud of what he was um, achieving at school and it was lovely to see he could pick that up and just continue and rework and um, I think they were creating a poster at the time and he could make it even better at home because he had a mum and dad's looking in and um, I was really sold on the programme there. But I suppose the story that really sold me on the programme and captured my heart was one of um, our Indian children was heading up back to India for eight weeks and her mum, ironically, was one of the parents at the time of our consultation that said, um, I'm not sure about the digital because good old fashioned stuff works and kids still need pen and paper and handwriting. So this mum was one of our slower takers onto the programme and yet um, one of our first paid in full. And the little girl managed to take her device to India for the eight weeks and she could access all of her class learning. She was writing daily on her blogs and um, the teacher could keep in communication, close communication even though she was in India. The little girl ended up presenting a, a journal about her trip experience um, and it was just wonderful and the mums come back and said how powerful it was um, because even though she was away she was still connected to her classroom. Didn't matter where she was in the world and I think that was um, something quite special. Has anyone had any comments from anyone about their work? Has anyone logged on and seen comments? Oh, yes. Yes. Mrs. Cochrane's been making comments about your work. And some of your friends have made comments about your work. So what do those, co when you get those comments, what does that do for you? When you've been doing some work and someone comments on it, what does that do for you? Makes you feel proud? What else does it might make you do or think or feel? It encourages you, Myra, doesn't it? And do you get, is that better than going through your books and finding the little bits the teacher's written? Because you get, the, how do you get that? You get it emailed? My goodness, so you even get emailed comments about your work. That's pretty spectacular. 